hello YouTube. This is a um, this is Mr. Chaco here. Um, this is going to be a tutorial on how to um, make an old Xbox 360 fan here into a um, USB powered. So um, let's get started. So some uh, things that you will need, obviously, um, an Xbox 360 fan. Um, I replaced the fan in my Xbox with a uh, Whisper Max, a Talisman Whisper Max. So I just scrapped this. Um, some wire cutters, electrical tape, or just any kind of tape. Um, you might need a knife to uh, strip the wires or wire strippers. And um, I use, you can use, really use any uh, USB uh, plug-in. But I used an old um, iPod one, you see the Apple thing, whatever. But yeah, that works fine. <clears throat> Alright, so first, there were, I cut the end off of um, the USB right here. Hold on. Alright, so I cut the end off of this right here, the USB, and there will be a um, black wire which is this one right here and a red wire uh, there might also be some other mesh in there that you can just cut back and uh, just uh, keep that away so you got a red wire and a black wire okay and then from the Xbox 360 fan you have a um, brown and white wire or brown and red wire right here that go to um um the, the two different fans and you have a blue and a black wire right right here that go to the two different fans so i was doing some fooling around and i figured out which was the positive and which one was the uh, negative so you get your xbox 360 fan here and there's going to be a plug here where you plug it into your Xbox. You can just cut all the wires off. And you want to get these two blue and the black wires. Strip them back a little bit. And you can twist them together. Uh, you can solder them together. Which I don't have a soldering iron right now. But yeah, twist them together so they come to a point together. And do the same thing to the red wire and the brown wire. I'll just do that for you real quick. Alright, I got the uh, two wires hooked up, the uh, red and the brown wire hooked together as one, and the blue and the black wire hooked up as one. Now on the USB, like I said, there's a black wire and a red wire. Now you're going to want to connect the red wire with the red and the brown wire on this end, and the black wire on the blue and the black wire on that one. So red with red and brown, and black with the blue and black. So I'll do that. For All right, I got the two ends taped up, as you can see right there, this one and this one. And uh, you can leave it like that, but I like to make it a little bit neater. So I'm going to put these two together like this. All right, you see that? And then I'm going to wrap some tape around it all so it's just nice and tight and neat. So I'll do that for you right now. Get some tape. Rip off a piece and then just put it on there and tightly wrap it around. And I'll do another piece. <clears throat> Alright, so you see that? Nice and neat now. And, um, if, like I said, if you had heat shrink tubing, you can use that. It makes it look a little bit neater, but this still works. So now, if I pull on it, you know, they're still still together. So I'm going to um, go over to the computer and um, show you uh, how it works. Alright, we're at my uh, computer now. Got a little uh, HP. 
you know. It's a laptop, don't hate, you know. Alright, anyway, so, um, got our USB here hooked up <coughs> to the fan. <coughs> so, I'm gonna plug this into my USB port over here. Um, down there. Alright. And you see the fans? They're moving. I don't know if you can hear that, but they're blowing. And to prove that they are moving, they'll stop them, let it go, and they'll start back up. So yeah, this is a great um, little simple mod, you know. Um, you can use it to cool down yourself, cool down your computer a little bit more, um, cool down your Xbox. So yeah, whatever you want. So um. That was a USB fan mod um, brought to you by Mr. Chaco. And, um, yeah, comment, um, rate, subscribe for more videos. And if you have any questions, just send me a message or a comment and I'll get to it. Alright, see you guys.